of all, I must apologize for like a couple of things. One of them is I kind of look like a hot mess right now because I was just literally laying on that bed. I made it for this video with like no pants on because I just came home from the dentist and it was raining and yeah, but I had an epiphany in bed. So I'm sorry if I look kind of weird and also I'm sorry that I haven't uploaded in a while but my epiphany has to do with that. Oh, and yes, I did dye my hair. I have red tips and I explained that in another video I tried to film but I really wanted to get this video up. Basically, I was just laying in that bed with my teeth aching because my braces just got tightened. So yeah, it hurts quite a bit. But I was laying there and I was watching a bookshelf tour. And I will link to the person's bookshelf tour because they were the reason why I had this epiphany. Basically, this girl was saying how The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer is a book that got her back into reading. I've been on the biggest reading slump ever. And I mean, I cannot pick up a book for the life of me. I thought maybe that it was because I had just finished the Emerald Atlas and I was kind of sad and I just kept looking for excuses and then my dad got sick and he was hospitalized for two weeks but he's fine now so I thought maybe it was that and then my brother came to visit and it was like a bunch of stuff together but I, I just couldn't do it. I tried reading The Secret Garden, I tried reading The Da Vinci Code and it just wasn't happening and I, and I couldn't even film videos because I was like what am I going to talk about? I don't have a book haul. I, I don't I don't have a tag to do, well I do have a tag to do but I don't know I just I couldn't get into it books were like no man's land for me and I was watching this video and it dawned on me has it ever happened to you guys that you cannot read anything because you have one book in mind that you want to read and until you get that book and until you read it even if it sucks and you stop it you can't read anything else like does that happen to anyone else because that's exactly what's going on with me. The truth is that I don't want to read anything else because I am waiting on my order of Rick Yancey's The Monstrumologist. And I just want to read that. Like, there's nothing else in this green earth that I want to read because I just don't. I, I want to read The Monstrumologist. I'm actually going to go pick it up and I will vlog what it's like for me to pick up books for you because... I think that some of you might find that interesting. I say that in the other video also. Yeah, I just can't read and I will not be able to read until I have that book in my hands because that is all that I want to read. But really, I just want to read The Monstrumologist, man. Even if it sucks, I that's all I want to read. I don't want to read anything else. And until I read that book, I probably won't read anything else. Does that happen to anyone else? I, I feel like, like that's kind of a weird thing. Does it happen to you? It, I'd love to know. It was such an awesome epiphany. Like I literally jumped out of bed, made the bed, put this on and I'm not gonna say if I have pants on or not because yeah so yeah that's pretty much this video and I'm so happy to have like realized this because awesome sauce